hey and welcome back. I don't know what the hell I'm doing now. This is all new to me. Okay, so where the hell am I supposed to go? Well, we have... Hey, they want me to dodge attacks? Successfully dodge attacks? Okay, I can do that. That should be fine. Hopefully. <laughs> Successfully dodged enemy attacks. Okay, let's go this way. We can do the next mission if we want to. Hey, Hogwarts. Hey, buddy. Alright, so we've done every mission that we've done, so everything else is new now. This is a dungeon. There yet. That's really interesting. I know there's wolves here, Jesus. Hi right there, bitch. Follow the road, see where it leads us. Uh, I think I'm lost at this point. You want me to dodge attacks? for the money. Are you all in here? Nothing in there. Yes. 
No. That takes care of that problem. Alright, let's go back. I need to do some dodges, man. No words. Wait, point. I needed to do some dodges, man. Best way to do that is to do the fucking wolf, because I knew what the hell I was doing. Alright, so this is all new to me, so I might be talking a lot more. So, yeah, welcome to my world, bitches! I feel like I've gotten a lot less thinner, too. I'm losing weight. I don't know if I should be more concerned about that, but whatever. I'm not too concerned about it. Let's go. Low, bitch, bro. Fucking low. Professor, I wondered, did you attend Hogwarts? I did. I am a proud member of Ravenclaw House. Why do you ask? I was curious as to how Hogwarts has changed over the years. I see. Well, the castle itself, as I'm sure you have surmised, is full of surprises. I dare say more than the staircases change around here. As for the students, well, they seem to get more capable every year. Although, we got up to just as much mischief in my day as you seem to now. I used to look the other way at all sorts of roguery when I was head girl. I can tell you, however, that I did once admonish a certain Phineas Nigellus Black for enjoying a sugar quill during a lecture. I, ah. I hadn't realized that you and Professor Black were, uh, students here together. <laughs> Appearances can be deceiving. You see, I was once wounded by time itself. Time itself? I never would have imagined such a thing. Ah, well, it was the risk I took with my prior position. You may or may not have heard that I was an unspeakable at the Ministry for years. An unspeakable? What does... Ah! As you might suspect, I cannot speak about what we did. Suffice it to say, the job was not without its hazards. Now, I hope I've satisfied your curiosity for the moment. You have. Thank you for speaking with me, Professor. Keep up with your wand work. One must always be prepared for mischief, both inside and outside of the castle. Got ya. You all care first. I'm pressing our Do I have to wait? Oh, mercy. That was pretty pointless. I hope you were able to take care of everything I had asked you to do. Professor, I completed all of your most recent assignments. Well done. Then you're ready to learn Expelliarmus. Pay close attention. The disarming charm may often be all you need to defeat the most powerful dark witches and wizards you might encounter. 
Spell casting requires a focused mind That's and a steady wand. Sweet. Good work. The dummy is here if you wish. Practice. You seem to have the right end of the stick, but keep practicing. Expelliarmus may save your life one day. Ready and so. Expelliarmus! Oh, it's very powerful, but... Professor, what can you tell me about your work at the Ministry? Your curiosity is understandable. Well, although I can't speak in any detail of my work, I can tell you certain... Interesting facts. Okay. Unspeakables work in the Minister's Department of Mysteries. Dangerous work at times, as you've no doubt guessed. Yes, Professor. Now, you needn't concern yourself with my injury. I made peace long ago with the fact that a sprig of Dittany, once plucked, will surely begin to wilt. I'm not a genius, but I have no idea what the fuck she's talking about. <laughs> You do seem to have come to terms with things rather well. It's a matter of perspective. Without saying more, perhaps whatever time I've lost was an exchange for time gained. And to dwell on such matters is a waste of the days ahead. At this point, no magic permits us to travel back in time. Perhaps one day. Yes, I can tell you that my years at the Ministry were well spent. And I'm as happy to be at Hogwarts now as I was to be in the Department of Mysteries years ago. If I may, Professor, I'm also happy that you're here at Hogwarts now. Kind of you to say. Speaking of time, perhaps yours will be best spent honing your defensive wand work. Yes, Professor. Alright. Huh. Must be on top there. We might be down below. Fills our stout hearts with joy to be in the presence of such arrogance. Must be on top there. Uh... God damn it, man. You make me climb up the fucking roof, man. Is it in the girls' bathroom? Handy resource indeed. Your field Oh, wait. Oh. Uh... No, I gotta get out of here this thing. Uh, hmm. hey, I'm gonna go higher up then. Those guys always have 500 fucking bucks. Italians and a historian. Oh, I need to talk to the other teacher. Okay. Professor. Do you have time to chat? I always have time for my students. How may I help you? I wondered if I might ask how long you've been teaching at Hogwarts. Well, it's been what now? <laughs> Seven swift years. Time does fly because we have fun. Essential in my opinion. An eager, positive and confident mind is the most open to knowledge, I find. Some of the professors may not agree with your approach. <laughs> well... Each of us has our own style, I suppose. Some in the teaching field believe that hard work and dedication are the only keys to success. But 
they forget what drives those things. If one cannot fathom why some would expend energy on gobstones, then one is blind to the enormous power of play. And that's why you teach the way you do. Precisely. I strive to be the sort of professor that I would have enjoyed in school. My experience was less cheerful. How unfortunate. Perhaps you wouldn't be who you are without that experience. Had I received a more traditional education, well, enough about my student days. You are here now, and it would be a shame if you didn't enjoy it. I'll do my best, Professor. Thank you for the advice. You are most welcome. <laughs> Try to have a bit of fun today. Huh? Sure. Okay, so where the hell are we going? We can go to the Professor Hill. Right now. I work now. Oh, I'm still doing that freaking mission. I forgot. Uh, I'll take the long way around. We got this in the bag, bitches! Roll, roll. Thank you. Fucking bastards. Oh, I thought it was gonna work. I still haven't done that fucking mission yet, motherfuckers! Alright. Oh, we haven't been here since the very beginning. No. Is she growing Punja's onion again? Who the fuck is this lady? Good morning, Professor Garlic. How wonderful it is to see you again, Lenora, dear. Oh, here. You'll need these for today's class. Uh, um, uh, a little treat for your auntie. Ah, oh, hello. Class, please welcome the newest rose in our garden. We do look forward to growing together. How thrilling it is to have everyone back She looks like again. a fucking hippie. This year will be filled with enchantment and Just because of her hair is so the most fucking long! Cultivated in herbology is knowledge. The prudent herbologist is no more afraid of the venomous tentacular than the bouncing bowl. Now then, today we will be acquainting ourselves with the mellifluous tuber known as the mandrake root. Akio. Great, we're gonna be making many Let's plants. Let's see if we can't make our fibrous friends a bit more comfortable, shall we? <laughs> First, let's protect our ears. Hmm. Now, everyone, grip their mandrake by the tendrils and give it a firm tug. <laughs> the soil should envelop that is the most annoying fucking plant I've ever fucking done. 
necessities. I got my headphones. Oh, that's just bullshit. I'm very sorry about that. Yours was a bit mature, I'm afraid. All right then, off you go. Splendid work, everyone. Now for our next task, we'll be planting dittany at our potting tables. You can all get started. Hmm. I wonder if hippogriffs like knot grass. That was a... Yes, Professor? Firstly, well done with your mandrake. They can be rather difficult to get a grasp of. It was just easy. I enjoyed it. Actually, I enjoyed it. I couldn't help but catch your enthusiasm. How kind of you. It seems you're already taking to herbology like a mandrake to fresh soil. That no, I'm just a jackass. Next, we'll be planting dittany. Let us find you some seeds. I already have some, Professor. Picked them up in Hogsmeade. You visited the Magic Mead. Wonderful! A prepared student is bound to bloom. I've arranged for you to have your own potting table here in the classroom. Wasn't easy to spare one on such late notice. Plant the seeds there now, and you can return to harvest them later. Even with soil, sunlight, and a bit of magic, they will take time to grow. Let's see how to balance my star thistle arrangement. Mifflers fancy or roses? Dittany's restorative properties make it a. The best time to plant a seed is last season. The second best time is now. Oh, that is bullshit. I have to be ready. Well done! Once it can be harvested, your Dittany will be ready to use in Wiganweld Potion. I'll let Professor Sharp tell you about that. Now, what say we branch out? Introduce you to a different sort of flora, the Chinese chomping cabbage. You'll find that some plants are better suited to uses outside of a cauldron. The cabbages do get testy without something to chew. Fortunately, I have a dummy for them to gnaw on. Be a dear and let them have a good chomping. Yes, Professor. They're in the other greenhouse. It's just at the end of the footbridge leading out of this room. Your classmate, Mr. Pruitt, has kindly offered to accompany you. Can, can, can I, I ask you a question? You whoa, whoa, whoa. And mind your Hold fingers. your fucking they horses, lady. Fight. Are you trying to fucking kill me by getting me killed by fucking plants? What the fuck is your problem? What should I be doing right now? I'd like you to get some hands-on experience with the Chinese chomping cabbages. They're in the greenhouse, just across the footbridge. Mr. Pruitt will assist you with them. So pretty much, you want me to get killed? The edges mustn't curl and turn brown like that. Hello. Saw you on your way to Hogsmeade the other day. Nice to meet you. I'm Leander. I'll be showing you the Chinese chomping cabbages. Up these stairs will take us there. But, your lead. Oh, nice no work in Defense Against the Dark Arts, by the way. Excuse me? Your duel with Sebastian. And he's good. <laughs> Thinks he's really good. But you outright slaughtered him. It was brilliant. Oh. Uh. Well, thank you. I nearly put Sebastian in his place myself. I mean, I would have if Hecate hadn't stopped me. Didn't she stop that dragon skull? Here we are. Home of the Chinese chomping cabbage. Go on. Gra now, see that dummy? Just toss the cabbages at it, and they'll do the rest. Look at that! That's not like anything they can get their uh, mouths on. <laughs> Mum planted some in her garden last year to keep the gnomes out. Did save her the denoming, but they left her honking daffodils in tatters. Vicious little bastards, aren't they? My kind of plants. Not like stupid booba tubers and bouncing bulbs. The kind of plants that just have your back in a fight. Uh, not saying you can't go it alone, but, well, imagine that wasn't a dummy. I suppose they could. I suppose they could prove useful outside of the greenhouse. Nothing wrong with a bit of backup, even if it is from a cabbage. It's chaos out there. Trolls in Hogsmeade and such. You can't be above throwing a cruciferous vegetable if necessary. Dogweed and Deathcap has more of them, if you're keen. Other plants too. Ones your parents wouldn't plant in the garden. You get the idea. 
Anyway, we uh, probably ought to head back to class. Take your time. I'll see you back in class. Yeah, I'm taking one more to for the road. Leon looks like he has a crush on us. Was he there or is he just nervous? Uh, we did see him. A, we did see him a couple times around. I attended to the Chinese chomping cabbages, Professor. Remarkable plants, aren't they? I hope they weren't too much trouble. Oh, don't see any bite marks or missing digits. And good, as you do seem to be quite green-fingered. Oh, I'm eager to see your skill in the soil continue to blossom. I am. As I am, plants offer so much. No, they don't. That's yeah, the other do. Plants offer us food. Magical plants have so much to offer. I'm eager to learn more. I'm glad. Herbology is a bounteous subject. Tend to your garden, and it will tend to you. Huh. Well, I suppose that's everything. Do come by for a chat sometime. I so enjoy checking in with my new students. And there we go. Oh, those mandrakes are really running. I do wonder about Professor. Make anything grow. We must first understand it. That goes for plants as well as friendships. Kindness and concern are as necessary in the greenhouse as in That was fucking hall. boring. I still got five minutes left! Well, let's go save. He's rolling at 10%. Damn, we suck. Ten percent, damn. What the hell? I thought I did that. Oh wait, there's probably something more. There is. Ten percent. Where are we going? Yeah, we got another enemy. Oh, we got two new enemies. Okay. Where's the other enemy? Oh, he's up top here. Ah, so that's what we defeated. The fucking dog hound or some shit. Sweet! We have too much stuff here. I gotta learn how to. Alright, so what quest do we have left? Potion class? Level four. Now let's do this mission next. And we have to go do. As you know, I'm gonna try to find those last three fucking diligent things, and I know they're in the school, so. I will, that's the next person we're doing. We're gonna help out our buddy over here. You stupid son of a bitch. There we go, okay. Good. Right, we're gonna try to find those last three, hold on. That's another inside the. They're inside the freaking thing, but I don't know where the hell they are. That's the problem. You can just face through the fucking wall. That's bullshit. I I think I know where one of them is. Oh yeah, I've already done that. I still think that's fucking funny. Alright, uh... I don't know where the hell everything is. That's the problem. I don't know where the hell the last three freaking Buzzsaw kills are.
Uh, I might have to look this up because this is fun to add to it. Because I feel like I've been through everywhere except for the hospital, and I don't know. Yeah, I've already gotten this one through. Avelia. That's the fucking problem. I've already been down here before. Fuck. Yeah, there's a page over here. Hold on. I keep pressing the wrong button. I know there's a page over here, that's interesting. Keep going there. Oh yeah, I've already got this thing. I smell a rat. God damn it. I should just look up a guy, but where's the fun in that, you know? We got a page out of it though, at least. Revenia. How the hell did I miss this thing? He was right next to me. We got some fucking issues, man. Revenia. All right, let's keep going up. Can't go through there. Revelio. Yeah, if you don't hear that, if you don't hear that freaking bell noise, uh, you will not be able to find anything. Well, I know what the hell I'm doing. I might be looking through those. I'm gonna be looking through this air, through this whole entire castle to get those last three fucking bullshit so I can finish this fucking mission. Cause I wanna get it done before I move on. Uh, but we got some killer plants, even though the lady wanted me to fucking die! Hope you guys have a nice positive day and take care.